This time I'm going to use uh, Rofi to do web searches and handling bookmarks um, using Surf Raw in the background to do all of this. And I did a similar thing using Fuzzy Finding before, so basically I'm trying to do the, the same thing on the Rofi program here. And it's quite simple, I'll say. So let's bust it out. I'll show you an example here. So if I want to search for something, um, what is that? Let's say I want to search Google or something. I hit tab to auto complete it, hit space. And let's say you search for Linux or something, right? And it'll bust out with your default web browser and so on and so forth. Let's do another one. Um, this time when it search for, let's say the AUR or something like that, space, and let's say you search for Tmux. And look at that. See, these are our results here. So on and so forth. As far as for bookmarks, uh, let's do bookmarks here. Um, if I want to uh, open one of my bookmarks, and this bookmarks is using tags also. So uh, most bookmarks that you do, they probably don't have like a tagging system, but this one, um, you can write your own tags in here. So let's say, for example, I want to open, um, I don't know, deals or something like that, right? And I have game deals here. And look at that. It opens game deals, subreddit. Or let's do it again here. Do we have slick deals in here? There we do. And there we go. We open up uh, slick deals, so on and so forth. So that's how you would handle bookmarks. Um, you can, you know, search for a tag or something. Let's say, uh, I think I have my name somewhere in here, right? There we go. So I just search for, you know, um, whatever my name is or whatever the tag is, then I can just choose from it. So let's say if I want to look at my um, show notes or something like that from uh, GitHub, just open that. So this one's for bookmarks. It's not like uh, web searches that we did before. Um, the web searches uses the LVs. So these are the web searches here. And they call these uh, LV or Elvis. Uh, for obvious reasons, it's um, a tribute to Elvis Presley. I don't know the history behind that, but that's what they call it. And basically, they're just, you know, searches for different websites. And um, you can type in, you know, whatever you want to search. It's like CNN or something like that. And let's say we search for, um, I don't know, Trump or something. Maybe they have something on him. Right, or something like that. You get the idea. Uh, they have it for different sites. Anyways, uh, pretty much it for um, how you use it. And I'll show you the code here so you can see how you set it up. Basically, um, all you got to do, well, you need to have Surf Raw install and the Rafi program, of course. But uh, all you got to do is, you know, type in this whole code here. Uh, you can change your, you know, your color scheme around if you want but basically I'll I'll place this in the description or something and then you can you know edit out but really the, the whole thing is we're using surf raw we want to use a browser with this and if you already have your browser variable uh, already set up in your terminal then you don't have to change this but um, <clears throat> if you don't then you have to type in like you know um, Firefox uh, Google dash Chrome Chromium or whatever you're using, right? And that will set it as your default web browser uh, when you're doing your searches. And what else is here? Pretty much it. Um, as far as the, the raw feed thing, I, I switched the uh, hotkeys around because by default, the uh, control space is to enter in, uh, they call it text mode. Um, but I like using tab, so that's why you can hit tab and auto complete the. Um, the uh, Elvis, all these fucking things confusing, but you'll understand when you use it. But anyways, uh, and then they have a little message that tells you, you know, uh, using tab as autocomplete. And then it has uh, the word web search when you're doing this. So when you're firing it up, it'll look something like this, right? So on and so forth. You get the idea. And as far as for bookmarks, uh, where do you save your bookmarks and all that? Well, it's the same place where uh, Surf Raw handles bookmarks, and that is in your config, uh, your dot config, Surf Raw, and then bookmarks. If you don't have this file, all you gotta do is just create a new one, uh, you know, an empty uh, text uh, document or something like that. And uh, inside it, what do you have to do? Well, I'll show you here. 
bug marks. So inside it, all you gotta do is real simple. Let me give you an example here. What else should we do? Let's say this one or whatever, right? We'll just copy a link in here. Doesn't really matter. Uh, if you want to make a, a bookmark out of that, just give it a name. What was this one called? Bible. 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 I don't know what the fuck it is. And then all you gotta do is type in the name of it, um, whatever name you want. And then, you, hit, you know, you can hit tab. Or I think you can use space too. But really, it only matters is the first word here and the link here, right? Anything beyond like uh, here, uh, it's not gonna count on uh, Surf Raw. So that's why uh, I usually like to hit, uh, what was that here? I usually like to hit tab, you know, and then do a uh, two semicolon. And then I can type in whatever tags I want. So this is this one, I'll call it Linux. Uh, I think this one's like a screen tmux clone or something like that or handler All right um, terminal <clears throat> you get the idea and after that uh, you save this file and let's bust out our um, program again or, or let's call the uh, what is that the bookmarks from our Rafi program so what we do is here and we search for what was it tmux or something like that so tmux is one of our tags that we created uh, or we added to uh, you know that line and all you gotta do is hit uh, enter and then it opens you know that link so on and so forth it's really not that hard and that's how I handle um, bookmarks um, because you know uh, I can use another browser in the future and all you gotta do is switch out the uh, browser variable and I'm good uh, some people they like to use bookmarks from you know their their default um, web browser I personally don't like to do that because in the future if I want to switch to another one um, I just have to you know install surf raw and use it so that's my preferred method of handling bookmarks and web searches just using surf raw because you know that's what I've been using all these years Anyways, that's pretty much it. As far as uh, creating your own uh, Elvis or like, you know, your web searches, I did a video on that a while back. So I'll link you that in the description also. Uh, basically, you know, um, by default, let me see here. Let's bust that out again here. They have some of the searches in here, but there's, you know, maybe you have your own site that you want to search from and you want to know how to create your own. Um, they'll just call Elvis's. Elvis's. Um, uh, and I'll link you that in the description. Pretty much it as far as the code. Um, same thing for the web browser, like we did. We do surf raw web browser, and then the was that the browser variable, and you know we're using this um, bookmarks file, and from there it'll filter it out just the first name and so on and so forth. And when you do your searches. Um, or your filter and you say enter it'll open up your bookmarks so on and so forth anyways just uh, copy the code uh, you can use your own colors if you want you don't have to use uh, what I use but after that you just bind to a hotkey that I showed you like last time so I don't want to go over it again but anyways hopefully you understood that um, that's it for this one